Arise, O compatriots! Nigeria's calling. You already know I'm coming in with the anthem. You know why? You already know why. Nigeria won again. <laughs> we won again. This is not a fluke. This is just this is just talent. You know what I'm saying? This is beauty. We won against Guinea-Bissau. I shall one leg back. We gave them whooping again. You know what I'm saying? Back again with another video, guys. You already know it's your boy M to the A to the C to the K A Y vibe. And I'm going to be giving my analysis, my reaction to the Nigeria Guinea Bissau to the Nigeria Guinea Bissau game. You know what I'm saying? First of all, shout out to Moses Simon. Man, that guy is a beast. That guy is a beast. Let's actually be honest with ourselves, man. You know what I'm saying? Did you see how he was just dribbling all of them through the ah? I will get those Guinea Bissau players, man. They chop dribble. Then chop dribble. Moses Simon. You know, I actually looked him up, you know, to actually see the club he plays for. So he plays for MC Nantes. See, Nantes, am I saying it right? But MC Nantes in France, League One in France. Man, I'm sure there's there are so many clubs that are looking to buy that guy right now at the moment. You know, like that guy is just too good. It's one of our star players. As a matter of fact, it's 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 it's, it's, it's just too good. Kilo de Okon game one, he was just dribbling them, entering the defense, D, left and right, here and there. Man, I'm so happy for Nigeria, man. But one thing I'm going to say is, I don't know if you guys watched the Cote d'Ivoire game, the Cote d'Ivoire-Algeria game. Man, that was an upset. I mean, of course, we know Cote d'Ivoire has a good team, but Algeria also has a good team. You know, even though they haven't played well so far, you know, up until the Cote d'Ivoire game, I did not expect Cote d'Ivoire to play them that, you know, to play them that well. Like, Cote d'Ivoire played them from the beginning of the game to the end. So now, which team do you think will win the Afghan now? Because it's getting hot. It's hot. Un bueno feli feli. You know, I mean, of course, my prediction is still Nigeria because I'm Nigerian. Of course, I'm going to support my team. But with the way things are going, man, Cameroon is hot. You know, they already qualified, of course. Cote d'Ivoire, they are out right now. They already qualified, of course. Nigeria too, they are out right now. They already qualified, of course. So out of these three teams, which team do you think will win the Afcon? I go with Nigeria, but to be honest, Cameroon and Cote d'Ivoire are on fire, man. So it's like, oof. This is going to be entertaining. I was like, yeah, you know, just joking with, I won't say joking, but I had this conversation or I asked one of my friends today, right? I said, if Cote d'Ivoire and Nigeria should play tomorrow, right? Which team do you think will win? But guess what? The guy's from Cote d'Ivoire and I'm Nigerian. So he said, <laughs> he even confessed. He confessed that Nigeria is hot right now. Like we are playing the game of our lives. You know what I'm saying? But he said, if Cote d'Ivoire should play against Nigeria at the moment, Cote d'Ivoire will beat Nigeria. Do you guys agree with that? Do you guys agree with that? I don't agree with that though. Mm -mm. But jokes apart, guys, I'm not going to lie, man. This Nigerian team is doing so well, exceptionally well, man. They are doing us proud. They are making us very, very proud, man. Like, the country is up here right now up here right now i'm not even gonna lie just give me a chance let me let me, let me keep ranting man my my country just they, they won their first game they won the second game first game against egypt 1-0 wait <laughs> it's just like quit the shot <laughs> anyways first go it goes against first game against egypt we whipped them 1-0 even with their mosala we still we team gave them beating. Understand? Second game against Sudan. Ah, I want you at it. At it, at it. Shout my leg back again. You know what I'm saying? That's 31. Now, 
Nigeria, uh, the, the, the third game we played, Nigeria, Guinea Bissau, I took whip for a game. 2 0. You know what I'm So the next team will whip them again. <laughs> you know, I'm just so happy, guys. When I'm happy, you know, I just, I like to, I like to express myself. You know what I'm saying? I like to express myself. So, like I said, I'm so happy for the team. Iguavon should keep doing what is what he, what he's been doing from the beginning of this tournament. You know what I'm saying? Please don't stop. And also, shout out to um, like my Ghanaians would say, shout outs to, <laughs> shout out, or should I say the way Ghanaians would say it, shout outs to um Moses Simon. He's doing an exceptional job. You know, it's, it's it's been exceptional so far. It's been amazing so far. It's been it's been it's been it's been. I don't even know the word. Look, you know, help me find the word. It's been brilliant so far. Everyone in the team has been brilliant. Look at me, right. even our, our captain too. Um, yeah, Trust Ekong. Awesome game. That man of the match against um that man of the match award that I got against Guinea Bissau was fully deserved. If you agree with me, signify in the comment section. If you agree with me, signify in the comment section. Let me see. Like the team is just awesome. 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 Hmm? Ah, man. And then again, I was also going to talk about... So, from the beginning of the game to the end, it was amazing, boy. Back to Moses Simon. Where did they get that guy from? <laughs> Even though where did they, what? Where did they get that guy from? Eh? Like I said, I'm sure so many clubs right now, I'm talking about top clubs, will be looking to sign that guy. If they don't sign him, where is their loss? Moses Simon, if you're watching this video, or more, you they play. Inacho, you they play. Everyone in the Nigerian team, you they play. In Didi, you they play. All of Una, Una, they play. Shout outs to, like my Ghanaian people, shout outs to all of Una. Understand? They be they play well. But yeah, that's also what I wanted to say. Um, I'm happy and uh, I hope they win the Afghan. You know what I'm saying? Of course, I hope they win this their, their next match. I just hope they win all their matches because that will be a very good record. You know what I'm saying? Because Nigeria is the only team so far in the tournament that has won all their games. Oh, am I right? Yeah. They're the only team in the tournament that has won all their games. So, yeah, we're, 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 we're doing well. We're doing well. So, anyways, guys, I just wanted to come here and just speak my mind about, you know, what I feel about the Super Eagles of Nigeria at the moment. I'm really, really impressed by their performance so far and uh hopefully they keep doing well you know what i'm saying and even better in their next game but um thank you guys for the continuous of my support i really really appreciate it so if you haven't subscribed to this channel please make sure you subscribe right now and uh also click on that bell so you can get notified when i'm talking about the bell beside the you know what i'm saying you you go try and say when you subscribe click on that bell so you can get notified when i post videos and um yeah there are going to be more videos coming and i'm going to be doing more reactions to subsequent matches coming up in the afghan so make sure you stay tuned and also subscribe to my second channel the link is going to be in the description please subscribe there are going to be videos coming up on that channel very soon so please subscribe right now if you haven't done it thank you for love and support nigeria let's go Arise, oh, I'll see you guys on the next one.